what's happening gamers welcome back to ghostbusters the video game remastered for the nintendo switch who are you gonna call ghostbusters don't forget to like comment subscribe and hit that bell to be notified when more ghostbusters arrives every day uh, for the next week or so ding because we got tons of other games like medieval and luigi's mansion 3 and all kinds of fun stuff in october so we're gonna continue the story now by all oh, wait nope we're we're gonna play this ah this is the game that vankman's always talking because he's vankman and that's new. I don't. I don't recognize that. And uh, yeah, we're uh, we're gonna totally continue the story. Just like. But um bum bum, but um bum bum, but um bum bum. Who's up for Chinese? Dun, dun, dun. We have to use the rest of the petty cash for that. Well, it's a great read, but nothing about that. I know that symbol. How? It shows up sometimes in Sumerian ritual magic. There's a statue on loan at the museum that features it. What does it represent? Just a symbol. Signifies a path to obtain great power. Most of my colleagues assume it's an old constellation. No constellation I ever saw. And I used to tell fortunes on Coney Island. Is that right? Did you wear a turban? No, man. <laughs> a red velvet cape with moons. It was plush. It was plush. Get this. The codex does indicate there is some kind of feeder system required. Mm -hmm. to channel energy to a destructor form. A destructor form? Like Stapa? It's entirely possible that system and this pattern are connected. It's possible. Wait, you said the Gozerian statuary at the museum is on loan. From whom? Evo Shandor, the architect. Well, the Shandor Foundation. They control Shandor's remaining estate and holdings. Evo is a big collector of Gozerian artifacts. By Evo Shandor, the architect, you mean Evo Shandor the genocidal maniac, right? That's what I was researching when Gozer attacked me. Shandor's architecture firm was involved in a number of projects around town in the late 18, early 1900s. Including Dana Barrett's old building on Central Park West. You mean the one with the extra dimensional antenna that drew Gozer to our world so he could attempt to destroy it? He had a nice view of the park, though. Yes, but he also did some renovations <laughs> on existing buildings and a number of public works. There was controversy, because a lot of people thought the work was unnecessary. Let me guess. He did some renovations on the public library building on 5th. Right. And the Museum of Natural History. Recent visitations, specific localized paranormal activity, singing Vikings. They're all connected to Shandor and this pattern. Hmm. Go to Ecto-1 when you're ready to leave. Hi, Shadow. I wish you could, like, actually talk to the Ghostbusters, like, hit a button and be like, Hey, what's up, guys? But... Doesn't work that way. Yeah. Oh, that would be cool. Yeah, it would be cool, but... I don't understand that lady that we saw... Oh, yeah, we had to rescue her. Why mm -hmm. is she still hanging out in the Ghostbusters place? Yeah, some... Egon, our new boss, called again? Please don't call Something him that. Something to do? Just... Peck. That's bad enough. Peck? Called again? He's not happy. He says that if you guys fire just one more unauthorized proton stream, he'll shut us down for good. What's considered unauthorized? Unauthorized? I thought our job was to shoot proton streams. Yeah, he's hanging out with Slimer. Why is Slimer in there? Why not? He's he's kind of a nasty little spud. So Vigo, we're going out. You have anything, uh, words of wisdom? <laughs> Call me Vigo the Despise. <laughs> Or we go the unholy. Oh, ah, never mind. I guess that's words of wisdom from Vigo. All right, mm -hmm. let's go to our next mission. Yay! Hopefully we don't get we shut down by the mayor. Peck. I don't know. He's likely to just sick Peck on us even more. You should get a closer look at the museum. Well, the mayor's going to be at the museum for the exhibitioning opening gala tonight. It's where I need to be too. Elissa. You sure make work fun for me. Is business casual okay? I don't have a tux. Are you kidding? He doesn't want you guys within three city blocks of the museum tonight. He thinks you make his campaign contributors nervous. Besides, that pet guy will be at the party too. Okay, Egon will stay here and finish analyzing the data from the library. The rest of us will go in by the service entrance of the museum and lay low. Peter can attend the party as Alyssa's guest and stay in plain sight of Peck. And that frees us up to check out the rest of the building. I love this plan. It's just dull enough to work. Ill, I'm gonna bring you a corsage. 
Thank you. Yes, wow. we just arrived at the loading dock. Keep Peck distracted. We're gonna poke around. Okay, I'll take one for the team. <laughs> sure you will, Bankman. Sign of the curator. <laughs> Alyssa told me he'd meet us right here. Well, that can't be good. Well, he gets to go to a nice party while everyone else is wandering around in the basement. I don't know who has the better job, but I'm thinking Bankman does. You want to know what's funny? New York City, kind of in the late uh, 80s, early 90s, had a rat problem. And guess what New York City is dealing with right now? The same thing? A rat problem again. Hmm. Well, I mean, there's so much, so many restaurants there. They have to put all their food out, like they, their trash out on the street. Wanted out of this box in a big way. Wait, can we Watch use? Watch out, black slime. Oh it's yeah. Check and eventually open a full interdimensional portal. Open doorway. Anything that wants to can come through. If a full portal has been opened, it has to be sealed using your slime roller. That's the key reason we developed that tech. Yeah, yeah, I got you, uh, Ray. Oh, this is nice. Mm. I always wanted to visit the Museum of National History. Yeah, except we're in the basement. I but... still want to take you to that. It's in New York City. Yeah. I know we drove by it a few times. We did. We have driven past it. Especially we just... in cabs and uh... stuff. Oh. But it costs money to get in there, I think. Or... Of course it does. Yeah. Plus... The main heart, the hardest part about going there is you have to find a place to park. But of course, if you take a cab, that's basically how you have to get there. There's hardly anywhere to park, really. When in doubt, clear out the boxes. Although, I'm going to mention something to you guys, which I haven't really talked about yet. But, um, the more damage you do, the more you get peck angry at you. Wait, what? Yeah. Although so, the game is not super meta that it pays attention to everything you do, but I mean, you kind of have like Peck on the back of your mind. Like, oh, it, it would be nice as if you didn't attack things as much, you didn't, you know, get a, a lot of damage. Wait, but. didn't you tell me like at the end of the game or something like it get they give you a tally for how much money you have to pay depending on how much something, damage you do. Something like that, but I mean, there's really no consequence involved because since this isn't a movie, one of the big things about this game is the developer Terminal Reality wanted to make it so everything was fully destructible. Like environments, walls, buildings. Yeah. You, you're a Ghostbuster, you've got a proton pack on, so things aren't always going to go according to plan. Yeah. You know? Door sealed shut. Somebody find the power. I thought I already did that. Well, I say the more destructible environments, the better. But it is kind of nice that you, give, you get an incentive to not destroy everything. Because remember, in the movie, when the Ghostbusters would do their thing, sometime, well, it would get yeah, like priceless things would get destroyed. Be like, oops. Um, why am I not able to? Is there a thing in the way? Ow! Sorry. Alright, let's try getting all this stuff cleared out of the way. Okay. There we go! Good work, Eagle Eye. Hey, hey. Look at this. Something's trail packing material down the hall here. Packing material and slime. Alright, let's go investigate. Those look fun. <laughs> Creepy mannequins. So, they just said that black slime creates weird portals. Oh. So, getting rid of the black slime makes life... Sorry, Winston. Makes life that's, easier for everybody. That's very interesting, because there's some people, like, in the scientific community, like, recently, that were talking about how antimatter possibly creates portals to other dimensions. And antimatter would be, like, dark matter or dark slime type stuff. Still looks like the stuff that's inside of a jelly donut, though. A little bit. Yeah, except for stuff you wouldn't want to eat. Well, yeah, I mean, that. Bye, black slime. Uh oh. Was that a possessor? Maybe. Looked like a level seven or above, too. Oh, dear. Used to fight class twos and threes every now and then. What happened to them? Watch your feet. Ah, the good old days. I'm more worried that she'll racing? stir things up around here. I expect we'll see her again sooner than we want to. I'm pretty sure we can. 
Luke! What? 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 Oh, I thought it was moving towards your feet. I was a little freaked out. No. So, how, what is the stuff you erase it with? Green slime. Oh. Okay. Neutralizes it. That's pretty cool. That's pretty handy. Bye! That's what the creepy whispering is, too. It's from... The well, slime. I, also the ghosts. Hmm? Oh, more black slime. You guys still want to do your job? This is my job now? Mm. Right. I don't know, I was just thinking about this episode in Star Trek The Next Generation where there was a creature basically that was made completely out of black slime and he was the epitome of evil. Like, all... Like, basically, like, on his planet... Basically, they tried to evolve, so they took everything good, and then they Hello? discarded everything Who's evil. In there? Oh, hang on, Amber. Somebody that wants out is who? Okay. Grip your mask. Okay, continue, please. Oh, I was just gonna say, like, they tried hey, to... Get, get in here and clear this off, please. It doesn't matter. Be ready for anything. This is... Oh. Their dialogue is more interesting, anyway. Well, I mean, your dialogue's interesting, but you oh. have to remember that these guys are gonna talk I, a lot. No, I just... I just was... It doesn't really matter. It... They just, they disregarded all the bad stuff from their species and then put it into this pool of black slime. And then the slime was lonely because they left him on the planet and they left. Okay. And so he became like pure evil, but they had to fix, they had to like take care of, yeah. It was an interesting episode. Anybody else seeing this? Uh... Um, guys, how do we get him out? Uh, Just shoot it with a proton beam. Wait, maybe oh, that wasn't the best Dr. idea. Uh, Z, meet the assistant curator of the museum. Is that horrible, terrible thing gone? Yeah, she's gone. You good? I, uh, yes, I suppose so. I'm a big fan. I even had you over for my daughter's birthday a couple years ago. <gasps> Is that so? Yeah, well, I think we can get you up. Sticker or button or mug or t-shirt or something when we're done here. 1989 oh, reference. birthday. We'll go through the oh, they did the birthday parties. Yep. He man, he man, he man. Ghostbusters, ghost. Yeah. <laughs> they wanted he man for the birthday in the Ghostbusters Aww. game. Uh oh. There it is again. Don't let it get me. Don't you worry. She'll have to go through me first. Uh, Ray? 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 Something is really Can wrong with Ray. Him. Hold him down, young blood. Okay, slime time. Yeah, because He Man came out in 1984. Where'd she go? How do you like slime time? Okay, well... Well, I guess we can put a trap down. Well, wait, did we already get it out of Ray? Yeah, we got it out of Ray already. Okay, because I was like, that doesn't look like Ray. I'm sorry, lady. Let's try something. Yes? Where is she? Oh, no. I thought that was going to work. I'm trying to tether her to this. I guess it doesn't stick to her because she's not a... Uh... Eh. Oh, well. All right! You guys are really good! Uh... Mama. That's fusion-based exorcism in a nutshell. Hmm. Better than somebody's head spinning all around in barbing pea soup. Will he be okay? How you doing, Ray? How's it buzzer? How's it buzzer? Buzzer buzzer. Ah. Oh, be fine. oh my gosh! Just got green slime Afternoon. all over him. Oh no! This place is Ray's gonna fire. get mad at you. Disasters. We better get to Peter fast. Ah. We found the curator. We're on our way to the Gozer exhibit now. 
Well, I guess he's okay. Yep. There's so much to show you. Uh, where to start? Things have been very strange since they started setting up that exhibit. Well, hello there. Dig it, Peter. Break out this test again. Ah, Z! You'll have to go through me first. <laughs> That's exactly what he said. <laughs> Just like a puppy. Every day is the first day. You have to go through me first, and it did go through him. This is going to be a bad idea. I thought Vanquin was supposed to be at the party. No, no, no! I want the Ghostbusters ejected from this facility immediately! Where's his honor, Pecker? We've got news for him and a photo op. The mayor is indisposed right now. Anything you need to tell him goes through me. Not happening, Peckley. This is for Jock. Jock. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Security, remove these men with excessive force. Uh, Why do the good ones always play hard to kill? Is that the girl who just took a girl hanging out with? What in the hell is going on here? <laughs> oh my gosh. Is the mayor in this from Groundhog Day? I think so! More possessor ghosts. Kid, slime them! Come on! Let's get these possessed guests. Hurts, doesn't it? Let it all out. I'll see you all on Rikers Island for this. Whoa, take a break. Do you ever shut up? Uh oh. This doesn't look good. Like Beauty pageant ghost. That's new. Oh, yeah. How do you like that? Oh no, another beautiful room to destroy. We're gonna do our best to not do that. Okay. Traps down! Come here, beautiful. Is this really a beauty pageant guest? Or I mean, a ghost? It was. Oop. Hi! How you guys doing? Oh! Hey, that's assault! You're not a ghost. Oh, great. Ooh, come on, rookie, you've got this. Did I put down another trap? Because I need to. All right, so yeah, I was wondering about that. I thought in the when we did the two-player of the Wii, we put down traps, but I couldn't remember if you were putting them down or um. your teammates. I guess you can all put them down. All right, I guess we can put them down. Try not to ruin the museum, guys! But there really is a specific button to put the trap down on Yep! Okay, that's cool. Get down here! Yeah, I mean, you would think, why would you put this creepy, like, possessed obelisk thing in the middle of a dance party? It's just, like, asking for trouble. There we go! Later. That's two. We screwed up a hornet's nest, kid. You think? Keep it tight, guys. Get behind something. Light him up. Whoa, that's, Whoa. that's an ugly one. Oh. oh no, we got more possessed Ghostbusters. How much time you got in there, Ghost? I just got a lot of ghosts. Or lo ghosts got a lot of slime. One or the other. Oh, this is terrifying. Yep. Get out of my buddy. Well, it could be worse. I guess we have to go this direction. Yep. Get in there! Yeah, there we go. Why don't you, uh... Hey! 
Behind you. Where? Oh, I don't see it. Crazy light show. Yep. How you like that, Bankman? This is such a beautiful building. I'm so afraid for what's gonna happen to it. Oh, somebody got a trap down? Mm. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can tell where it is by the little yellow yep. light. Watch it. Come here. Why is that lady standing so close to us? Oh. Oh, that can't be good. Yep, that's definitely not good. <laughs> All right, you guys go after Alyssa. Be careful. I'll get to security. I love this plan. I'll man the security cameras to triangulate them on the monitors and talk you through. See you soon, Ray. Let's go, guys. See you soon, guys. Dr. Rutherford, if you'll show me to security. Okay, it's just Winston and us. Oh, there's a Rome exhibit. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, it's probably some evil Roman artifact that's actually possessed or whatever. Oh, well, let's uh, take a nice look around now that we can. You never know when you're going to find a fun little artifact or secret. Hmm, maybe there's still some hors d'oeuvres. Okay, you know what? I'm good. Oh. <laughs> I can't tell if I did that or if the game did that or... Yeah, I'm going to have to play something really happy after this because this is kind of creeping me out. Oh, well, we do need to finish Link's Awakening. There you go. There you go. Well, I mean, the Romans were extremely brutal, so... I mean, it makes sense that there'd be some really weird evil artifacts from Rome. Oh, we came from here. Never mind. This is how we got into the party. Unless, unless it's not a Roman thing and there's just a Roman exhibit in another room. What? That's hard to say. Punch. I want some of the punch bowl. We don't know if the ghost, like, did anything to it, though. I mean, I would have a very hard time eating at this establishment after that. Also, this is yeah. why you never want to have a gozer exhibit. Make a oh note of that, gosh. New York. Oh my gosh. Yeah, exactly. You never want to have an exhibit based on a person that tried to invade your uh, plane of reality and enslave everyone. <laughs> Actually, they didn't try to enslave. They tried to wipe out. Yeah. All right. Oh. Well, well, that's actually pretty easy, so we're following a trail of slime. Yep. A purple slime, or whatever it is. Uh-oh! So Luke is the... Is the girl in the black evening gown that was floating, is she the one that was hanging out in the Ghostbusters house earlier? I think so. Oh, that was a mannequin. It's hard to tell. Oh. Oops. We yeah. destroyed a mannequin. That was her in her evening gown. Oh, okay. Evening attire. She looked different, but I guess it's because she was all dressed up. Oh, we're in the Mayan exhibit. Oh, that's creepy. Catch up to them. Ouch. Sorry, Bankman. My aim could use some work. If you really think about it, though, like, a lot of those ancient cultures had some pretty brutal past. And he... It is, it is a wonder that, like, when you go to, a, like, a, a museum exhibit, it's... Now entering the Civil War exhibit. I'm surprised more of them aren't, like, cursed objects in there. Please help preserve our displays by not touching them. <laughs> Sorry! Preserve the displays by not touching them. I, you I, just stopped uh, over it. it. <laughs> oh my uh, gosh. I'm, I'm bad. How much money have I ended Oops. up? Do we have any upgrades available? Let's let's check. Oh my gosh, Luke. Did you see that? Like, Holy cow. They had a video of a kid that was on a class field trip and he fell and he put his hand out and he ended up like literally put his handprint on a priceless like million dollar painting. Oh my gosh. And he was with his school. I forgot what country it was in, but it was like all over the news and like it was so like he basically da did permanent damages to the painting, but he was like just he just tripped and fell cuz they were in I don't know. It was just so it was so weird to see like 
I don't even know what his family is going to do. Like, I don't know if... How recent was this? Um, I think it was... I really feel like it was somewhere in Asia it happened. Because you could see the footage from the kid, that like, tripping, and then he... Yeah. But I think it was a few years ago. Oh, great. The Mayan exhibit. This won't be weird at all. Wait, were we in the Civil War exhibit, or were we entering the Civil War? Oh, it's just different pictures. I just felt so bad for the kid because he didn't mean to do anything. Please help preserve our stuff by not... Oh my gosh! Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa! Uh, we're a little busy, Ray! Well, that looks like it can still be preserved, right? Sure. Maybe? I'm trying my best! That that big round thing that fell kind of looks like the Mayan calendar a little bit. Oh, this isn't freaky at all. Yeah, the Mayans definitely creep me out. I mean, the fact that they did all those sacrifices and stuff. Alright, let's... Try to go on the path less traveled. As long as they don't have an Egyptian e uh, exhibit, I'm good. Peter! Peter? Why sh I thought she didn't like you. You have a way with women, Pete. I know. I guess he can be as jerky as he wants in the... So he's basically Felix from... Uh oh gosh. Well, I mean, I guess... Girls like to be noticed. He at least noticed she was there. I don't know. Oh my gosh. Get to the temple, the glowing one. What do you think I'm trying to do exactly? Okay, this is not going how I. Whoa! I planned. All right, this is creepy. You think? No, this is totally normal. So uh, right, I'm, I'm getting a raise, right? Yeah. I'm definitely hearing some creepy voices. Yeah, that's a big ten four. Uh, creepy Mayan pyramid it is. I don't want to go up here. It's creepy. Oh. I can't believe they had this huge exhibit in the library. I really, I mean, I you think mean it'd be fun to, to go to a museum. I think we should. Well, now, after seeing all these cursed objects, I'm a little bit hesitant to do it. Ah, it'd be fine. What's I the mean, worst that could happen? I've seen a lot of Mayan and Egyptian exhibits in the past, and I never really thought once that they could be cursed or something. But... This is cursed. That is cursed. Hello. But I guess it's actually possible. Now I can open things. Now what exhibit is this? Mm, still Mayan. Oh. Yeah, still Mayan. This is a huge exhibit. Did they just say cannibalism? I think they did. I think they may have. Good thing I talked over it a little bit. Me and my big mouth. They were creepy. What isn't creepy? Oh, I can't, apparently. Where is the thunder coming from? Anybody want to explain where the thunder is? Okay, fine. I don't find... let's see... Cultures that aren't creepy. I don't find the Amish particularly creepy. <laughs> They're pretty nice. On history lesson, I suppose. Oh, wow. This can't be good. Um, guys? Yeah. Creepy. I figured as much. I find that creepy. Those on darts it is! Woohoo! I'm sorry, did you want to hurt me? Well, it didn't quite work out for you. Oh. Nice shooting, Tex! Okay, can you guys uh, get out of my way? I don't want to melt your faces off. <laughs> wow, Pete's actually pretty good at handling that uh, proton wand thing. Yeah? Good for him. How is it raining inside of a museum? Uh, well, for one... Oh, the, the ceiling, ceiling is broken. I've actually been in a museum that it was kind of raining inside of it. Really? Yeah, I mean, it wasn't a ghost sighting or anything. It just... Always scan your environment. Because you never know. Hittites, Mennonites, 
Phoenician, Babylonian, Assyrian, Mesopotamian, Sumerian. Ah, he's making it all up. Just one of those things. Ah, you pick this stuff up. You know, around the office. Sure, Bankman. Wait, was he, like, identifying different civilizations as he was going by them? I don't know. I thought those were all Mayans, though. Come on. Like... Hi, honey. How was your day? Man, we've reached the security office. This one is a shambles. It's been sabotaged. Black slime all over the place. Only a few of the cameras are still working. When you're free, no rush. Open gate 3487. Just for kicks. Give me a minute. Ray, stay away from any possession. Oh my god. <laughs> Dr. Weatherford, if you're still there, can you go catch Dr. Stance, please? <laughs> he got possessed. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay, I shook off that possessor. Found a different security room. Can't find Dr. Rutherford, though. I must have scared him off. <laughs> you're not pretty when you're possessed, Ray. Oh my gosh. You're not pretty. You're not you when you're possessed. Have a Snickers. Just pass through there. Okay, we're on it. Thanks. <gasps> I think I have an extra Snickers from school in my backpack. A Snickers? Yeah, I got one when I was when I was oh. done. I think I have an extra Snickers. You know the difference between this exhibit and the other one? The soldiers in this one have guns. Why did oh, you say that? Oh no, Winston. Winston! Why did you have to say that? All people say they did see a lot of ghosts on the battlefield in the Civil There's War. There's even ghost sightings in Pennsylvania for Civil War ghosts. Well, I mean, so many people died. I know. See, we only had to worry about our, colonial ghosts when we were in uh, our, New York and Massachusetts. <laughs> this country almost didn't survive the Civil War. Although yeah. colonial ghosts were kind of creepy. So. It almost, oh. like, got destroyed. Let's just pass through here as quickly as we can. <laughs> yeah, I didn't want to do just thinking happy thoughts. Well, thankfully, most of them have swords and cannons. Oh, at least they're gonna fight each other. That works. Yeah. You know, some people can't just get rid of a grudge. I'm getting heavy interference on the monitors. You guys in trouble? Couldn't have been the American Revolutionary War, could it? Or the war on drugs? Oh, it's the Revolutionary the War? war? On drugs. So. Oh, he's saying it couldn't have been that one. It had to be this one. Right. Because this one was... Great. I don't like the fact that they have guns. This is gonna make this trick. Ouch! Sorry, Union. Even though you were right, it's time for you to... Well, you know. Get down! There we go. Bagged and tagged. Yeah, actually, the... So, take out the cannons? Don't take out the cannons. Oh, please. I'm just gonna deal with the ceiling, because, you know, that way, uh... My, uh... Oh, I think it was my grandfather's grandfather. Oh. Ran, oh. ran one of the cannons in the Civil War. Cannon operator? Cool. Mm -hmm. On the Union side. <laughs> we all know I had a relative that fought in the Civil War, but uh, it's probably not good to bring him up. I think your relative fought on both sides and kept going back and forth, was it? Yep, that was him. To keep getting more and more money on both sides. Well, I mean, you know, he was an entrepreneur. Uh, he was trying to find ways of making money during the wartime, and, uh, you know. I wouldn't say it was the most, uh, best way of doing it, but... You did survive the war! <sighs> oh, I am ruining this exhibit. I'm so sorry. Yep. The trumpet is a nice touch. Well, I mean, being in Pennsylvania, I mean, so many of the battles were fought right here in the state. On this land. Come on, big guy. Time for your nap. Thank you for your service. Rest in peace. Yeah, fight it outside near the trap. Uh oh. Sorry. This is crazy. Isn't it? It's just 
it's almost like we're at night at the museum. Kind of. Because everyone's coming back to life, but they're not uh, wax figures, they're actual ghosts. Oh. Look out! Above you! What? Why why above me? What exactly is going on? Wait, was this hill here before? I don't think so. I think they brought the hill here when they came from the ghost world. I mean, no, I think the hill was there. That's part of the really? exhibit. Incoming. Yeah, it was supposed to be a landscape of the war, like the cannons on top of the hill. Oh. They were making like an exhibit to show what the battle would have looked like. I kind of like it when people get possessed in this. They go, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm pretty sure in real life it might not look that pretty, but it's pretty funny in this game. Sorry, that ceiling can be replaced, though. All right, where's the trap, guys? You play hardball, Rook. Well, there's a trap over there. Yeah, no, I got an idea. Hey! Oh, yeah! Where's Keep that general going. guy? <laughs> All right, watch this. See? You see what I did there? Freeze like ray. Yep, they took some casualties. Oof. Well, that was, uh. Ah, uh, no, I'm I'm good. I, I don't remember, think I need any more history here. To stop by the gift shop. No, I don't. I don't think so. All right. So I hate to do it to you guys, but uh, I think Aww. that's gonna do it for uh, this episode. These uh, museum levels get kind of long. Like, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And we will see you with more Ghostbusters tomorrow on K-Wings Let's Plays. God bless and happy gaming. See ya! <laughs>